What's good, guys? If you want cheap, fast, and reliable NBA 2K20 My Team coins, head on over to NBASafe.com and use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout. If you're looking to buy a stacked NBA 2K account with max badges and more, visit SportsTMB.com. He has been in the community for years and has hundreds of reviews. Click the first link in the description to get your account today. What's good YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back with another NBA 2K20 My Team video and guys today we do have some market talk. We got some MT methods for all you guys. Before we get into the video make sure to smash that like button to get 120 likes on this video. That would be greatly appreciated. Smash that sub button at 10.5k. We're doing a 50,000 MT giveaway. That would be greatly appreciated. If you guys smash the sub button you guys are new over here. We hit 10k. Thanks to all you guys. Let's keep it going man. We're so close to 10.5 for that giveaway and also i'm buying and selling mt on twitter also doing giveaways on twitter so make sure to follow the twitter links in the description also have an instagram if you want to follow that hit me up for mt on there as well but yo today we got the new bob mikado mcadoo whatever the hell his name is i don't care honestly i'm gonna be completely honest if you guys use the diamond card bro that card is honestly really good. I really, really enjoyed this card. He's really athletic. He played really good on defense. Now, we are getting these cards, and I would say about very soon. We should, we're should we getting them in about 30 minutes. So in 30 minutes, these cards will drop. Um, you guys don't know. The, the other cards are pretty decent. I mean, like, I don't really like Spotlight Sims. They're kind of boring. But here's the catch, honestly. We're going to have some MT methods on these new cards because... It's easy. It's easy money. You guys are going to make MT simply. Um, I'm going to go over it right now. So when those cards drop, they have these diamonds and these amethysts dropping. I don't even know the cards. But here's the plan. When they drop, if you want to make a lot of MT quick, whatever the new... J I know they're... I don't really want to read the stats because it doesn't really matter, but... They have a new like Williamson and somebody else. The Amethyst and the Diamond is something you want to pay attention to in the Spotlight Sim cards. Because when Spotlight Sim cards drop, you can make thousands of MT on them. Because they're so like non-competitive. What I've been doing, bro, is honestly, you could sit on this filter and just relax. You can make a lot of MT. I feel like that's a snipe. We're about to see though. Dude, the Spotlight Sim filter has been very, very, very good for a really long time now. And honestly, I think you guys should definitely pick it up and try it out. That's a snipe. I'm picking that up. So right there, we got Nicholas Claxton for 4,300. He's actually around like 7K. So that's a huge W right there. He's actually more. So let's see. Nicholas Claxton's that expensive, man. We just got a W on the snipes. 9,500. Did you just see? I got him one minute later, bro. I got him one minute later, man. Look at this, man. We got 100K for free. <laughs> That's a wager for you, bro. Let's see. Nicholas Claxton. Um, Let's see. So we just got him for 4,000 something. He's going to sell for around 9,000 MT. Now, that filter, man, is really good. Also, let's talk about some other things. Let's talk about the market inflation in this video. So if you guys don't know, man. The market is rising. As you guys remember in my video, Ben Simmons was rocking around 340. He's rocking around 400K. Perzingis was at 200. He's at 220. Draymond was at a buyout. He's up. D-Book was at a buyout. He's up. Porter Jr. was at 250. He's up. J.R. Smith is up a lot. Um, the Literally, he's up to 300,000 MT. I got him for 250 in my video earlier. Luka was at 200 to 190. He's at 250. You shall see the market go up. It is a good time to sell today. And also, I heard the market, the, the auction was glitching. I don't know to what extent. But all I've been hearing is, bro, the freaking auction's broken, bro. I can't do this no more. Enable's not working. This isn't working. This isn't working. Bro, I understand it's 2K. 2K is trash. So I understand if the market is breaking. It's not my fault. You just have to somehow find a method to enable those filters, man. Like... I'm probably going to pick up a Terry and a Trey Young to try to snipe on the Opal filter because that highly, highly increases my chances on getting snipes. So right there, I'll pick that Trey Young up. That's cheap. I'll pick up this Terry up too, honestly, just to get them off. We're going to test out the enable filter in this video for you guys. Let's see how it does work because honestly, I would like to see if it does work personally. We're about to find out. Um, hold on. If this stops lagging. Okay, let's go. Enabled, Opal buyout so oh my god there's that many cards we got chauncey we got lynn we got francis oh the opal filter is officially broken but one thing i could say 
is that the center galaxy opal filter isn't as broken but we're going to scroll all the way down here we're going to try to find a snipe let's see if anything pops up honestly with this much scrolling i think the auction does automatically refresh but the fact that there's this many opals for buyouts is kind of crazy like donovan mitchell at 100k that's honestly a very good card right there um lynn's rocking around 90k kuzma's around 90k i didn't even know the market so so like i said it's weird a lot of the rare opals ended up rising a ton a lot of the opals that were buyouts or close to buyouts ended up going to buyouts which is super weird in my opinion Ooh, a pal is saw for 100k i don't know if that's a snipe um oh an ai for 100k is that a snipe Kyrie? i don't even know what's going on with the auction anymore man i'm just so confused myself i don't know if that ai is a snipe it probably is let's see Allen Iverson, 100K, yeah. It's crazy how a Galaxy Opal AI is that cheap. So you could just see how many cards are actually that cheap right now. But honestly, one filter I'm going to say that's going to be deadly. And there it goes, man. Sabonis ruined it. Center Galaxy Opal. You might be able to sneak one through here. If you could somehow get a Galaxy Opal power forward center. It's just crazy how crashed the market is. And honestly, if anyone did try out Pal Gasol, let me know because I'm honestly kind of tempted to try him out, even though he's very unathletic and I do not like unathletic players. So right now, what should you guys be doing? I have like, bro, bugs. I have this Galaxy Oval. I have that Galaxy Oval. Bugs. What do I do, man? I need to make more MT. Should I sell my cards? Honestly, like I said, bro, go ahead and sell your cards and thank me later. I'm going to say sell your cards. Why? Because simple. It's very simple. It's very simple. You sell your cards and you buy back on a Friday or whenever they drop super packs. Like I said, these decade super packs are still out, bro. They're out for another four days, five days. We got five days left on these super packs. So now, if you guys want, honestly, you could pick up some of these cards that are still in packs, even though they're still not like they're not down in price. If anything, everyone did go up in price. So if you really do want to pop these packs, you probably should pop them now. This is probably your best chance to pop these packs to make MT. Definitely would recommend. Also, TTO, obviously a great way to make MT. Spotlight Sim filter to make MT. And one filter that was popping off yesterday is the Amethyst filter. And not only that, we have another really OP filter I'm about to show you in a second to make MT. Um, that's somewhat a snipe. I'm not really... I'm trying to get my collector level up, man. I need that 750 token. So unless they do have a token market update, I could go snag a player. But we're about to show you the most OP side filter in the game. And I noticed every single Friday, they drop that 92 Amethyst player that's really OP and really budget. For instance, Mobamba. For instance, Dean Wade. Yo, this filter right here should make you thousands and thousands of MT. Why? Because look at this quick MT right there. 1800 silver 23, make 300 MT real quick. This filter is so damn deadly. You will literally see Dean Wades pop up for a thousand on the consistent basis. We just refreshed. Look how many Dean Wades are up here already. Look how many, man. That many Dean Wades in that amount of time. So if you want to make quick, fast MT and you really don't have a lot of MT, this is going to be the method. This goes for every single Amethyst that drops in promos like fan favorites, flash packs. Because think about it. If thousands of people are pulling the packs, thousands of people are going to pull the most common card in the set, correct? So in that case, Dean Wade is the most common. You are fresh with the max bid and just consistently, if you get out cards for 1800 and under, you're going to make 300 MT clean, a pop after reduction, everything. So it's quick, fast, and easy MT just off this little cheap Dean Wade. And look how many Dean Wades are getting posted for 2300, man. It continues to go up and up and up. There's so many Dean Wades. And honestly, if you do, if you really do like Dean Wade, you could invest in him. I honestly don't think it's the best investment. When you could possibly, he could possibly sell for like 35, 4K. Like Mo Bamba did go up in price. He was going for like three, but then he went up and then he went down again. So that's what's pretty much going to happen with Dean Wade. He's probably going to go up to like three to 4K and then he's going to consistently drop. But yeah, other than that, man, I would recommend selling your Opals. I would recommend selling your Pink Diamonds. And honestly, moving on with life, we're probably going to see some crazy content this week. They did drop every single new card in the game. So that's something you should think about. But yeah, other than that, man, that's all we really got for the video. I hope you guys did enjoy. I hope these empty methods did help you out. Let's get it. I'm trying to get Bob Mc Mikado, Makadu, whatever his name is, for a gameplay for you guys. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Have a good one. Stay tuned for more content. Peace.